Hi Gears fans, welcome back for a new episode of Topic in Peels. We know it's been a while since the last upload of such content, but today we come back with a little curiosity. As many of you will know, in these days the Coalition has released a video dedicated to the Christmas holidays. You're wondering, what's strange? Why dedicate a video to this? Well, there's a little detail that might have escaped you. Let's go back a moment. During the support of Gears of War 4, the Coalition has included the Cantus and Scourge among the multiplayer characters, with new lines related to the new features. However, the latter were not recorded by the historical dubber who gave them the voice at the time of their introduction in Gears 2. It is very likely that Robin Ekin Dones was engaged in other projects and did not have time to go back to work on Gears of War 4 after the small cameo in the role of Min Young Kim in the prologue. Well, maybe some of you already guessed what we want to talk about. Usually dubbers are engaged on one project at a time, so they happen to be unavailable to perform insights or record new lines of character dialogue. At this point, why call Downs again just let him dub a video of just two minutes? But above all, why underline it in the video, when in the past the main dubbers appeared without being mentioned directly? It's possible that the video dedicated to Gears Mass 18 was nothing but a nice tribute to the dubber who at the time was already working on another project at The Coalition. A project that should be just Gears 5. In fact, Downs not only dubbed Kim, the Cantus and the Boomers, but also lent his voice to the famous scientist Nile Samson. We know that Kate and Elle will retrace the route made almost 30 years earlier by Marcus, looking for information on her past. One of the main stages will be New Hope, where the Delta Squad found the artificial intelligence that Nice had created in his image to protect the facility. It's possible the protagonist will find new material from the scientist, explaining how and why his colleagues and the subjects have escaped to Mount Kadar, and maybe who are really the locusts. All this new material would be dubbed by Robin Neckin Downs. If we go on with our theory, it's possible that Downs will also play as Ukkon, the scientist of locusts introduced in The Rise of Ram, which in our opinion is nothing but nice mutating into a monster. From the words of Rob Ferguson, we can almost certainly say that he will be the main enemy of Gears Tactics, but it could be also the locus that Kate sees in her nightmares in the announced trailer. If we are right, the creation of that artificial intelligence would be a small confirmation of his technological capabilities and a possible idea on how the swarm flock actually managed to connect the DBs to the network of the swarm, but this is another theory that we'll discuss later. Let's stay with our feet on the ground and concentrate on the certainties. We know that New Hope will return, and so surely also Nice Samson in human version. Unless they want to create a complete more of the same of Gears 2, it's reasonable to expect in edit recordings of the scientist. One of these could be about Mira, which, as confirmed by Curtis Webb, she comes from the scientist who worked in those secret laboratories. Oh, we almost forgot to tell you that Dongs also lent his voice to the Cyrus, that some of them survived and are waiting to be killed by the chainsaw. That's all for now, we hope you enjoyed the video and we wait for you in the comments to know your opinion about it. I am Screech93, this is Gauss Series Videos, thanks for watching!